Hi friends! Today we are drawing yummy ramen in a cute bowl. Let's get started! We're gonna draw a bowl first and start with the big half circle. Now for the top of the bowl we are going to draw one long curve which will start here, finish here and it will have small gap on the side. Let's go back to this gap now and draw two small bumps and one line in between. These bumps are for the noodles that hang from the side of the bowl. And we will draw a big curve here and one more matching line. and smaller noodle next to it. Next we are going to draw more noodles inside of the bowl. For this let's draw one big arc above our two noodles that we got. Smaller arc from the right side. And one more behind them. Now let's draw matching stripes inside of each shape that we got. It looks great! Now let's throw in more yummy ingredients like eggs. I will draw two halves here, one in front and one behind. And let's add circles inside for the egg yolks. From the right side I will add a fish cake, one arc and simple flower shape. Let's draw a vegetable in the middle. Curve goes up and back down to the noodles. Two more curves for the sides. And leaf-like shape on the top. Let's add more noodles behind to give our drawing a little bit more dimension. And now we can add chopsticks on the side. Let's draw four lines first. Close with the curves. And now we can finish the shape of the bow with small curves on the sides. Alright, let's add the bottom of the bow. Two lines and the curve. I want to add some ornament on the top of the bow. And let's draw some wavy line. And one more matching line below. I will add some details to chopsticks and ingredients.
And the last part of the drawing would be the face. I will draw two ovals for the eyes. Round highlights inside. Maybe tiny eyebrows. And a cute smile. And that's it for the line work. Now let's color our cute ramen. And after that we will take some time to play around with our finished drawing. And we finished our coloring, I am super happy with the result. Let me know in the comments below if your drawing turned out adorable and cute. And of course your drawing doesn't have to be exactly the same as mine. You can change as many details as you like to get your own artwork. As a sample you can change the style and color of the bowl or change the ingredients. Thanks for drawing with me today and I can't wait to see you next time. Bye bye!